Hello everyone, my name is Jerry BR and welcome to Pokemon New Pokemon Snap. So I haven't started the game, all I did was put it in, update it. So let's get right into here. I cannot see that notification at all. Game saves automatically, don't turn it off. So yeah, I'm super excited for this game. Um, last year I had done a replay. Oh, they actually have voices. No, we'll see, we'll see what their voices are like. Select my appearance. I think I'm this first guy right here. Um, yeah, so I played the original one sometime last year. I forget when exactly. Oh, did it give me a default name? Oh, it already has my name. Good. Yeah. So. Ah, oh, they're so cute. Laboratory, ecology, and natural science. Ah, oh, it's. I'm just hoping this game is non salvadorable. I feel like this could have been, if this came out last year this time, it would have been the the game of the year <laughs> with the pandemic and everything. Oh, it's Just let me know how the audio is, if there's any issues. It's too quiet, too loud. Hi there, I'm glad you made it. Welcome to the Laboratory of Ecology and Natural Sciences, or LENS for short. Oh yeah, so since I picked it up at GameStop, I also got this super cool poster. Uh, it's, it's the one side, shows some of the pictures you could presumably take in here. Or super cute one with taking a picture of Pikachu chomping down on an apple. Super excited for that. Alright. Mirror. That's that's not a tree. Are you a real professor? Is there such a thing as a mirror tree? Cause that cannot be right. Are mirror trees real things? No. No, it's some ancestry thing. I'm researching Pokemon in their natural environment here on Florio Island. Yeah, so. yeah, that's not all. The professor's going to study every single island here in the Lentil region. Yeah, so that's our new region for here. No one's ever done an ecology, ecological study survey like this before. It's going to be amazing. No one? I should be getting a certain explorer. Todd? You've read the stories of Captain Vince, haven't you? No, but I would. Is this a real book? Even counting him, Professor, your survey is going to be the first of its kind in a hundred years. That's awesome. Thank you. Well, thanks. This is Rita. Her parents are good friends of mine. She's here on vacation while her school's on break. I'm not just here to goof off, Professor. I'm your research assistant. <laughs> huh, that's right. Yeah, I appreciate the help. Before we go over what you'll be doing in this program, why don't we step into the lab to get settled? Yeah. Great you are, Professor. I'll lead the way. Yeah, I uh, so wanted to show. I've had this for years. It's a Pokemon Snap shirt. And if anyone can read what I assume to be is Japanese, I would love to know what my shirt says. And hope it's not something offensive. Or I don't know. Alright, allow me to explain. Lentil region is absolutely teeming with Pokemon. It'd be weird if it wasn't. Photogra Photographing these Pokemon helps us learn more about them and their ecosystem. 
That's exactly what you're here to do. At night, you might even get to see glowing Pokemon. They're really pretty. Now, without further ado, here's your research camera. I've got the same one. We can use them to communicate with each other and the rest of the team, too. That's right. It's more than just a camera. It should keep in touch and analyze data on the fly. I'll also serve as sort of an ID badge for you here. Just take good care of it. Okay, that was cool. Oh, is this going to have motion controls? It's going to have motion controls, isn't it? Awesome, right? Professor invented it. Can I explain how to use it, Professor? Sure thing, Rita. Assist away. I'll go take care of some other preparations. Yeah. All right, come on, let's go outside. Tutorial is based on the following layout. I don't know what other layout I could possibly use. Can't, I don't move this apparently, but I want him close to the middle. Yes. Ah, oh, it makes so much. It's not pointy at all. Rita, where are you? You can use motion controls to aim your camera too. Hmm, that does oh, not seem. What is this tilt? Did I do that? Try getting a shot of that Pikachu. First, move the pointer so it's lined up with Pikachu. Easy. You see that sheep appear around Pikachu just now? Yes. Whatever that sheep is around is the subject of your photo. Ah, Think good. Rita, he's, he's gonna run away if you keep talking. Oh. I agree, I was gonna take a ton of pictures. Nice and big, Pika. Oh. What happened to. Why is my lens, like, tilted? Doing it for a very long time. Oh, right. You can adjust your camera and motion controls from the settings menu. You can also adjust both of the pause menu while you're out doing research. Hey, Professor, you've covered the right. basics. That's right. Let's get this show on the road. Hello. Photos taken three. Pokemon photograph two. Anyway. Oh, no. Well, you can choose a photo with them or by moving the pointer. So you don't need to decide which one to show me. Well, obviously, the zoomed in one. Alright. Take a gander at these, Professor. That's right. From one to four stars. Came with a system to help us understand and categorize how Pokemon behave. Photos of Pokemon in ordinary state get fewer, more unusual behavior means more stars. Alright. Camera keeps logs of what was happening when you took it. Okay. The posts. Size is straightforward. The larger your subject appears in the photo, the better. Just direction. Try to get it facing you, obviously. And its placement. Try to get in the center. 
And then finally, you'll get bonus of other Pokemon in the photo. I know that is a lot of info. Let me boil it down. Remember this. Get the Pokemon nice and big in the center of the frame, then snap the shutter. Here's my evaluation. Looking good. I, other than sitting around and waiting for him to show up better, I don't know how I could have improved on a standard picture. A new discovery. Oh yeah, now oh, Pavilion. Nice work. All right, it's in flight as it should be. Two thousand. One star for Pavilion. How was it? What do you think? Once you get your photos evaluated, you use and fill out your very own Pokemon photo decks. That'll be a great milestone to work toward. Right. That about does it. I think it's time to set off on your adventure. That's right. We got travel around lentil. That should about do it. See this pod? Carry you on your photography expeditions. By the way. It's called the Neo one. That's right. I knew it had some <laughs> name. It's the best. You can teleport to far off places in no time flat. Here's the thing. I finally put the finishing touches on it not long ago. A little help from someone I know. Is it Professor Oak? See, it makes use of energy hotspots scattered throughout the Lentil region. Come on, Professor. Details can wait. Fair enough. Let's get you moving. Come on in and touch the camera to the console. That's right, I for, uh, No, that's not really teleporting. Why did it go invisible? That's just taking off super fast in the, the air. I probably should have read that hint or tip. Alright. So here's our path. Oh, we are just right into it. How many okay, I get like 68. Is there stuff happening behind? Bullfriend. Loki. Pichu, come on out. There's so many Pokemon about. Anything in the water? I, I love how every direction I'm looking, I feel like I'm missing Pokemon the other way. A Badoo spot. Wurple. Uh, those are not. Is there something in the tree? What's that? Mushrooms. Some other kind of glowy fruit. Another wormhole or two. This thing is weird. Oh, it's a crystal bloom. Ah, oh, that's bad. Oh, are you following me? Alright. What else is going on here? This, oh, wait, no, those are more. We spawn them. Actually. That might be a, a better. 
for a shot of Bidoof. It's not a great one. Hmm. Where's the top? Oh, this is Dojo. Nice close up of Magic Carp. I'm curious how, like, how long is this level? Because at this rate, you know, we could be going for ages. Oh, right, here's the ending. I, I guess. Anything I'm missing behind me? Good time in Florio, Na Florio Nature Park. Right. Um, just like before, it's time to show me some photos you took. Go ahead and choose one photo per Pokemon. Oh yeah, I, why did I? I knew all this. All right. I think this one's probably the better one, especially if it counts the other Pokemon as. All the ones in the background. Boofaland. That's a picture. That's not Boofaland. That's Grokey. Alright, Pichu. Only got the one. Badoof. Easy. Wurmple. I, I thought I took more than one of Wurmple. Forges. Not covering face one. Swana, uh, Magikarp. Man, I should have. I did not take nearly as many. So it's a picture of Comfy, but it's not clearly visible. Uh, why that one? All right. See what the professor thinks. Do we get to move on to a new region or new area of the island? Right. right, it's new. Fairly common behavior. Thirty-five, not bad. All right. Let's see if we can improve on this. Is better. It's not a lot better. I guess we'll keep the new one. A new discovery. All right. Nice work. I should go. Uh, I thought the more credit for having four of them in the picture. And that Grokey. Pichu. Yeah, it's not a good one. But it exists. Why is that? Oh, I guess centered. Is it? Man, placement is important. A new discovery. Right. Bidoof. What do we got? Wow, why was Bidoof such a good picture? I know I could look at the scores and that would exactly tell me why, but. This is my this is a Wurmple my best picture. 
that'll be hilarious. A new discovery. Thirty-seven hundred. Nice. Now swan. A new discovery. Nice work. Forty-one hundred. Nice. I think for a basic picture of magic carp, I think that's pretty good. Yeah, Three thousand. A new discovery. I wonder which Talos the picture is focusing on—the top one or the bottom one. it yep all right let's see what he says overall oh i forgot you can level up in this come on oh only thirty-three thousand. one last thing let me tell you about research levels the research level on a course tells you how much progress you've made there once that level goes up you may see pokemon behave in ways you haven't seen before key to raising your research level is to observe all types of Pokemon behaviors. This means getting photographs of them in every category from one to four stars. So in short, fill up that Pokedex, keep that in mind, and you'll be on the right track. Let's get out there and snap lots of photos and cherish the encounters of Pokemon you have along the way. Never have guessed it was your first trip out there. Keep up the good work. Nice. Smack down in the middle. You got a score of a thousand or more in placement. See? Together, friends, you got a score of 500 or more in the other Pokemon category. Alright, save them to my album and let's roll. Um. Oh, is this. Do I want to save any of the ones I. Oh, wait, no, it's all of them. Well, oh, that's how you, you can. That's right. You can adjust pictures. I'm just curious. All right, so we can play with the brightness. Oh, that's that's interesting. Ah, that's. I keep forgetting. I don't see much happening. This is. That's what I wanted. That's what I thought I was playing with last time. <laughs> Ooh, that is. That is a cool picture. That's. Oh my gosh. Alright. Uh, well, so the filter options are silhouettes or none. Oh, that's cool. Uh, zoom out? Eh, too much. Too. I'm guessing I can unlock like more um, more more filters for my picture taking. Do I actually have to save all these? I 
purple got the gold star. I don't know why. I'm just gonna save this just in case it's important. I don't know if it is, but I have no way of being sure. All right. Oh, I can just save it like that. That would have been easier. Young girl who loves Pokemon helps Professor Mirror as his research assistant. Curly ponytails are her signature look. Alright, good to know. I honestly could not have told you right now she is. Does she have curly ponytails? Because I don't think she does. Can we go on a nighttime photo shoot later? That's a weird thing to ask. Not yet, but soon, after a little more practice. By the way, don't forget you can come back to the lab and take a look at your photo decks anytime. I'll say more about that when you stop by the lab. Don't let me keep you any longer. Go have a good time and snap some photos. I will do exactly that. What are the settings? Motion controls, no thank you. Camera speed. Are these not the same? I'm just gonna turn them off a little. Frame guide. Sound, all oh, that's probably good. So that should auto upload any of the here. pictures then. Help. This is the professor's lab. Not that it's your first time here, of course. This is where, where, where this is where the professor does his research, works on mechanical stuff. In fact, he pretty much lives here. Right. Anyway, let me give you a quick rundown of what you can do here. That server there is where we store our research work. There are a few things you can do with all that nice. data. First, you can check your photo decks. That's the encyclopedic record you're building with the photos you're taking. Isn't it cool getting to put together your very own photo decks? Then. Next, there's your space. That's where you see your personal photo album. Okay. By the way. So those are where I save my... Yeah, that's where I save my photos. <laughs> which is... Mm. Edit your Did you cover what we can do on the internet? Oh yeah, that was it. If you use the online internet feature, you can see photos from players all around the world. If you really like a photo, you can tell the photographer nice job, giving them a little digital medal. They're called sweet medals. Give all you want, people love getting them. That's right. You can also see other photographers' rankings in each score. Okay. Yeah, it sounds pretty straightforward. Maybe I should try everything out. What is your space? Uh, take me back outside. Yeah, let's go explore again. Headed out on another expedition already. Let me tell you one more thing you can do with your camera. You want to scan. I give you details about your surroundings. It tells you about nearby Pokemon and points out anything unusual. Counts as unusual. You've never given me a solid answer. Basically, anything that makes the system go, check this out. That's not a very detailed answer. I guess that's all the detail we're getting out of him. Yep. You'll get the hang of it once you try, Rita. Would you mind demonstrating? Yeah. Leave it to me, Professor. Alright, get that camera ready. Alright. X. Oh, 
Yes. I, but I'm more interested in the vehicle. Yeah, what's that? Yeah. Is Pika gonna get jealous and hop in here? I don't think he is. Oh. Yep, I see it. All right. What is it? I'm guessing I could do this <laughs> to Pichu to get him to turn around. Uh, hey, Professor, let me go do my job. Explanation's all done. Thanks, Rita. Don't hesitate to run a scan. I'll tell you a lot about your surroundings. I know. I've been doing this for 20 years. First of all. All right. Try taking lots of photos of Pokemon at the nature park during the day. We will work to protect nature and live together. All right. So are my levels based on individual areas? Hey you two, turn around. Groki, I got a picture of you. Hey Groki. Yeah. I guess I should get a nice big picture of that Dodrio. Oh yeah, and probably one more of the Boofalans. Boofalans. Charge for something you did a Pokemon do this? Where are you? What? Where did, where did he go? Oh, he flew away, didn't he? <gasps> He's flying. Get that stupid thing out of my face. Where did he go? Oh. Just some stupid Taylo. Wasn't there a was Dodrio here last time? Oh. Right before they all mm. I don't know how I was expecting to get them to to look my way before. Scattering. I like that I'm just keep pulsing this. Ooh. Oh, I guess if I come back during the day, it'll be. Oh, Magic Carp, I forgot you. That's a terrible picture, but I just want to see what he says.
Oh hey, another one of them. Turn around kindly. Um, yeah, I think I'm about out. Yeah. All right. So let's see. Did we level up? Thirty-one pictures, fourteen Pokemon to choose. Mm, probably that one. Pichu. Hopefully, yeah. a lot of these I only have one picture of. That should make it. Oh, I did get a. It's not a good picture, but I did get a picture of you. Oh, it's a two star for some reason. That's, a, that's magic carp's not gonna be that good, but all right. Show me what you think. Show me what you think. Tell me what you think. Professor is not my professor. All right, which one you like more? It's a lot bigger. All right, say bye bye to that old loser picture. It's bigger. It's facing the right way. It's not in the middle as much, but. Oh yeah. All right, Silver Star, good deal. Boofling. Big. Oh. Ah. I thought I almost beat it in every category. Badoof. Actually, oh, a Gold Star. Yes, please. Alright, it was a gold star last time, so I don't really need to beat it, but hey. Good. I gotta make these harder to beat. Yeah, it's okay. I know it's not the greatest. It's facing the wrong direction, but other than that, it scored pretty well. Taylor. I thought it was like the same picture. But worse by two points. That is a close one. That's funny. Well, I guess we keep the old one. It's a two star photo. Oh. Two gold stars, thank you. Oh, I had a diamond last time. Oh, even better. Wow. It's so rewarding. I don't know why. Yeah, it's it's And like I feel like that's a lot of points for that picture. Nice work. All right. Is that better? Yeah, a little bit better. Yeah. Now let's see if there's no way this one should be anywhere. This 
better placement, but no, thank you. Um, yeah, I wasn't expecting that to be out. Alright, did I level up? I better have. Otherwise... New stage. Keep an eye out for changes, no matter how small. Up the way. Thanks to the progress you made, got something to report. Fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. Yeah, I think my photos, the ones he has, are pretty good. Photography seems to be going well. I think you're about ready for a nighttime visit to the Florio Nature Park. Here's the thing. Hopefully, you'll get to see one of Lentil's greatest wonders a glow called the Illumina Phenomenon. You're the one who discovered how that glow happens, right, Professor? Yes, I am, but explaining the process scientifically was just one step toward my ultimate goal. Find the special Pokemon spoken of in the Legends of Lentil. Is there a legendary Pokemon in here? No, no they're very much real. You've seen the photos from Captain Vince's travelogue. Haven't you? What? Barely tell what's in those photos. They're ancient anyway. Literally a hundred years old. Right. We can discuss that later. For now, enjoy your nighttime outing. I will. Because we're going to take pictures at night. No map. Okay, so the level is unique to that location at that time of day. But I, there can't be that many levels then. I don't know why I already forgot this was at night. Ah, oh, that's cool looking. God. Oh, score bunny. Ah, oh, he's running away from me. What's the, differences in their behavior? the boof and all look close. The doof. Is it size or quantity that matter? Where is that? There's a Pidgeot or a Pidgeotto or something, wasn't there? Ah, oh, Square Bunny, that would have been such a nice shot. Noises are coming from this bump in the ground. Oh, it's a pincer. Is that, a, is that something pincers do? Ah, oh, that's a worse shot then.
Oh, sleepy Badoof. I want to turn. Oh, Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto. I wonder. Oh, did I miss my chance to take Squirrelly's picture? Noctowl, you should be. <laughs> or not Noctowl, Hoot Hoot. Alright, he won't turn for that. <gasps> Combies! Where'd that score bunny go? What have I been missing? How is that any different than what I already had? Who's stomping? Bunny just chilling there. And that has to be the one I submit. Alright. Let's get these evaluated. Show me the points. Oh yeah. That last one's the best one, without a doubt. Sleepy Badoof. Man, I am surprised at how much I... Oh, that's... Oh, I can't do a three... I can't do a two star and a one star? That's dumb. It's gotta be that one. Duck lit. Uh, These are all. Oh, this is the two. Why is that the two star one? Rookie. Pichu. Cute. Hoot hoot. Oh, this last one. Uh, whatever that does. I've taken like three pictures of that now. And he's finally interested in seeing it. It's a good one. Ooh, 2,000 for size. Four, ah, it's a diamond. Ah, that's a good one. All right. It's bigger. Oh, wait, no, it's just better posed. Man, I like the sleepy one better, but... My rule is to go by the points. Oh, this is... Oh, it's a two-star boof. For land. Caterpie. Right. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's new. Three stars. That is not enough points for three stars. Do you like the pincer? I would be terrified if that came out of the ground at me. Don't be, yeah, it's not the greatest of shots. Ooh. 
I think that's my lowest score yet. Terra, that's a pretty good one. Forty-two and a diamond. Ducklet. That's right. This was the two stars. Yeah. Now the swana. Oh wait, what's the? Which one's better? Ah, it's a little worse. I'm surprised. The new one's better. It's bigger. Yeah. Silver to diamond. Hoot hoot. The size. Yeah. Bronze to diamond. Yeah, so what do you want with this? That's what we call the Illumina Phenomenon. Oh, no points for it. You're just... Write that down. Alright. Did I, did I level up? Oh! I was so close. You got a score of 2,000 points or more in size. You got a score of 1,000 more in direction. And all that night exploration. Registered at Crystal Bloom. By the way, thanks to the progress you made, I've got something to report. I feel you almost your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. I, I forget what I'm... What am I looking at again? What was I looking at? I definitely want you saved and you saved and you saved. Oh, I know. I know what I was. But that doesn't seem to be an option for me. Alright, so you can take 72 pictures, run out of pictures, and your adventure will end. Whoa. Oh, they are talking. Something incredible has happened. Here, take a look at this. Is that where I was? Because there shouldn't be that much heat and energy going off there. Here's the thing. We got near that field of flowers. Picked up an incredibly strong energy reading. Also. Its source seemed to be moving too, if only slightly. Which suggests what we've got here is <laughs> an Illumina Pokemon. We can't be sure yet, but I suspect so. I wonder why it showed up. Did you do anything special? That's all I do is special. I also doubt that it appeared when it did by chance. I think you should be the one to investigate the area where that reading is coming from. What? Ah, I want to go see too. You can watch through the monitor with me, Rita. Right. Please head out as soon as you're ready. Well, that's not as fun. But do I get a new area? Hey, hey. Oh, I didn't want you were space. Or maybe I did. Yeah, I did. I want... I don't want my album. <laughs> Goes into my album anyway. I want... Is it the research log? Uh, top one star photo score top two. But I have... Oh wait, no. 4683, yeah. I've done 60 scans. What is my info? Okay. 
Um, but I want, yeah, the Pokey, it's the, not the Pokey decks, the Photo decks. Is that what it's called? Yeah. All right, so Pokemon. Okay, I thought Swana had her ducklet, like, right behind her. I thought that's what that blue part was, but it's not. Wow, I actually just did use one of these pictures to learn something. This research lab's not a waste. Let's go. Is it a new place on the map? Uh, ooh, the Illumina spot. Yeah, they're the exact same. Why are they separate? see a gigantic glowing Pokemon? <laughs> Jirachi? No, not Jirachi. Celebi? <gasps> oh. It's a Meganium. Gonna sell toys, aren't you? That's a game of the Illumina Pokemon. Quick, get its picture. Um, um, sir. I'll see. What am I? Oh, what's happening? Chasing after it does not give me a lot of great photo opportunities. They're mostly just dumb. Am I hitting it? There. How am I going to pick one of these pictures? You sure you don't want another hit of that? Off it goes. <laughs> so it just poof gone. I don't think that's how. Po I don't want to say that's not how Pokemon works because that's kind of how Pokemon works. Alright, now we just have the hard decision of... Oh. oh. Ah, yes. <laughs> what do you mean? In which it's not shown. Well, I'm glad I took this many shots then, if only two of them counted. I 
I'd be pissed if none of my shots counter. Alright, so it's a two star. Two diamonds. That's what we like. I guess there's different flowers. Ooh. Level up. And you receive the research title Gentle Wonder. Oh, a new filter. Oh, good. Ooh, cell shaded. That's gonna be cool. By the way, now that we've got that aluminum Pokemon, I feel I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your footers are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. Yeah. Um, Alright. Ain't got any good. Yes, you're back. That was amazing, right? Wasn't it gorgeous? Wasn't it huge? And was it saying something? Easy there, Rita. Take a deep breath. Look who's talking. You're practically dancing, Professor. Yeah, moving on. There's no doubt about it. That Meganium was an Illumina Pokemon, just like in the Legends. Remind me what the Legends say about Illumina Pokemon again. Didn't they supposedly save Lentil from a huge disaster a long time ago or something? So the story goes, yes. Lumina Pokemon were also said to have distinctive patterns and to glow with unusual light. Sounds like our new friend. Yes, to the letter. I'm convinced the events in those legends really did happen. Discovering the true history of this region could be the key that opens up all our research. Hang on, wasn't there one more thing that you were going to mention, Professor? That's alright, it's pretty late. Let's pick up the conversation from here tomorrow. What benefit does that serve gameplay-wise? Alright, did you manage to get some sleep? Well, as Rita already told you, we're preparing to launch an ecological survey spanning the entire region. And no sooner had you arrived than we suddenly found an Illumina Pokemon. I think there's a connection, Professor. I am 100% Illumina. I eat those crystal blooms for breakfast. They put them in Coke. That's why it's so addictive. Fascinating things are bound to happen if you come with us. Yeah. Well, you know, maybe. I. I'm just professor in the wood who likes children to work for me. For a scientist, you sure can be vague sometimes, Professor. So I think it's a good idea. It'd be way more fun with you along. There you have it. Ready to officially join our research team. Can I say no? Oh, I can't say no. What kind of game is it where you can't say no, I'm not going to join the team? I want a team badge. <laughs> Doesn't want to join team. Immediately wants yeah. team badge. Uh, it's like you're a board to right. What are you waiting for? Adventure waits. I, I'm curious if people are already selling like replicas of these badges. I don't even know what to call it. All right, I typed in lentil team badge and got people selling lentil seeds. Don't know what I expected. Not to rain on your parade, Rita. But I need to get a couple more things ready first. We can't just be take cap capturing every Pokemon we see. 
Oh, come on. Just a little bit longer, all right? I promise it'll be worth the wait. Explain next time you're headed out to do some research. Oh, present. Officially join the Lentil Region Research Team. Nice. Alright, let's head out and do some research. Alright. I'm not your full fledged team member. I have something that would come in handy. An apple. Explanation would you do the honors, Rita? Yes, sir. But is it just me, or have you been getting me to do a lot more of the work lately? That is true. So this is this is fluff fruit. They grow here in the lentil region. Looks like an apple, but they're sweet and tasty, and they make a great snack for Pokemon. They may look just like regular apples. They're way lighter and softer. Oh, so I can a Pokemon on the side of the head with them and it'll be fine. That's what you're saying. You'll probably make a Pokemon's day if you toss it one of these. Yeah. Might give it a concussion, but you know. I'm ten. I can throw apples at animals if I want. Or fluff fruit. E button. All right, come on, Pika. Yes, eat, <laughs> eat the fluff fruit. All right, this time we're, we're aiming for him. Oh. I was, I was having fun. Uh, pretty easy, right? Yeah, that was easy. Like throw an apple at a baby. I guess now we just wait until the professor gives us the green light to move on. Well, I've got an idea. You should try testing out fluff fruit and taking some more photos in the meantime. That's a terrible idea. Let's do it. Finish explaining, I see. Thanks, Rita. I've got one more thing to tell you about for now. I thought it would be handy to have a quick way to share what we see and learn in the field. Are you too familiar with Lend Talk? Didn't you already say this is like a phone? It rings a bell, I think. It's a communication tool folks here in Lentil use. Rita, let's say you notice something exciting in the field. You can send a photo and a description over Lend Talk. I can use it to send things I notice on the monitor, too. Sounds super fun! Look, Lend Talk messages.